studying, working out, and hanging out with friends. They are some of the many ways in which we experience music. But what most people don't know about are the harmful side effects, such as hearing loss, that can occur when listening to music at high volumes. It's not something you may notice immediately, but it can have long-term effects. Sometimes, like when I take my earphones off, it, my ears kind of hurt. So, and then I don't hear very well, like if someone's trying to talk to me and I have my music playing and I take my earphone out and then I'm like, what'd you say? Like I can't hear him as well, so yeah, I, I guess I would say so. Well, loud rock concerts and loud movies have often been blamed for hearing loss, but now new technology like this iPod here with its trendy earbuds are also causing problems. The easiest remedy? Just turn it down. People with the little earbuds, you got to think about the physics of that. You know, that earbud just has a little bit of air that it needs to vibrate. Brody Wellman is an audio engineer with performance facilities on campus. His hearing is important to him. In fact, it's his job. In the studio here in Wiedemann Hall, he records anything from student recitals to guest artist performances. He believes that people should take better care of their hearing. He says that the long-term effects are what people need to be aware of. Besides hearing loss, like tinnitus is what I'm afraid of, where you have a constant ringing at a constant pitch, and you, I mean, some people can't sleep. Just remember, making good decisions about how you listen now may determine if you'll be able to listen in the future. For Studio B, I'm Jessica Oakley.